Awesome. Hi, Kate Ellison, 857 Southeast 32nd Way in Melrose, Florida in Bradford County. As you know, if you've been listening, I think bringing a strip mine to the New River in our county is a very bad idea. I'm particularly frustrated because in accepting the phosphate mine permit application, you allowed the miners to have control over our discourse for a year and a half by preventing real communication between you and your constituency. Not to mention freezing in place the land development regulations that we had at the time. This was a manipulative move on the miners' part and has poisoned the well, so to speak, only figuratively so far. Why did they tell you they would not be submitting a permit anytime soon, all the while they were preparing and almost immediately submitting their application? They must know they could be poisoning our real wells with this mine. Part of the reason that citizens are making such a loud public noise about this possible strip mine is that we can't tell if you hear us, or what you think, what your issues are, what you care about. Does it matter to you that lots of people from this whole region are worried about how this mine could in impact everyone's lives? Do you only listen to what the four mining families, their employees and consult consultants tell you? Do you believe their disinformation? No one knows. Because this mine doesn't seem to be going away, there should be a public workshop. There should be an honest and open exchange of fact-based information and ideas, not the tight control or the resulting speculation that we have experienced. We could all be working together to bring healthy, productive jobs to our county instead of experiencing this opposition. As I've said to your silent faces so many times, please reject this permit and immediately institute a moratorium on mining permits until our LDRs can be updated. Our grandchildren need us to modernize our regulations for this mine and for the future of North Central Florida. Thank you.